This first-hand information about the Z Fold 5 comes from a tipster called Super Rotor, who has a solid track record. And the Z Fold 5 will only have two major design modifications from its predecessor. The first is the camera arrangement, and it now seems that their flagship S-Series lineup will have a cohesive design throughout their whole flagship product portfolio. According to certain sources, Samsung will introduce a new water droplet-shaped hinge that would enable the phone to fold with no gaps. Samsung also handled this in a unique manner by adding an IPX8 grade to its new massive design. Samsung will include a new water drop-shaped hinge, which will enable the gadget to fall entirely flat and will also allow for a more robust, dust-resistant display. Many sources also claim that there will no longer be a crease in the center of the display. According to rumors, the Z Fold 5 will weigh roughly 10 grams lighter than the Z Fold 4, putting it somewhere around the 253-gram mark. The Galaxy Z Fold 5 and Z Flip 5 are expected to become official in August or September of 2023. Both phones' foldable Super AMOLED displays are said to be around the same size and to feature a refresh rate of 120 Hz. The Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5 will use the same camera setup as the Galaxy S23 Plus and Galaxy Z Fold 4, which is a 50-megapixel wide-angle camera, a 10-megapixel telephoto camera, and a 12-megapixel ultra-wide camera. The camera system of the Galaxy Z Fold 5 has some disappointing news, which is not what we were hoping to hear. Because Watch World has confirmed that the Z Fold 5 will maintain the same camera module as its predecessor. The new 200-megapixel HP2 shown in the S23 cannot be utilized. To be honest, this was always a possibility, and there were only a few stories that began with the HP2 being in the Z Fold 5. What do you think of the Galaxy Z Fold 5 in conclusion? Finally, what are your thoughts about it? So without been said let me know your thought in the comment below, and if you are new here please subscribe peace out.